It's me, Lemon, wishing you all a happy Valentine's Day. I love all of you very, very much. And all of your support. Seeing all of your comments always makes me smile. You guys have no idea how much you mean to me. And, yeah, I'm sorry I didn't plan this video out or script it that much, because, like, uh, I mean, I was, I am planning some audios, some better ones, with more planning behind them. Yeah. Uh, for this week, I just uh, sort of ran out of time. And yeah, I was too busy being kind of lazy, to be honest. But mm, whatever. mean a lot to me. And you guys kind of deserve better, but uh, I'm trying to be better. Uh. So let me keep you company. If you're alone on Valentine's Day, just, I don't know, need help sleeping. I'm here for you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Being alone can be very, very hard and sad. Trust me, I know. I mean, sometimes there are moments where you would like to be alone and loneliness, or wait, no, uh, loneliness is never good. Being alone, yes, it can be nice, but loneliness and being alone are two different things. You can be alone without feeling lonely, but being lonely is just not a pog. Because humans are social creatures and when you're alone, you start to doubt yourself, and sometimes, a lot of the times, when you're alone, you start to ask yourself if you'll ever be in anyone's company again, just subconsciously. Your mind thinks that you feel like you're going to be alone forever, and it can hurt really, really badly. But you're not going to be alone forever, okay? And 
as long as you're alone, I'm here for you, because I love you, and I always will love you until somebody comes along, and even after that, I'll be happy for you, I'll be cheering you on. All I can do is remind you, because I'm just a voice inside your head, unfortunately. But if I wasn't, I'd give you a big hug. best to take care of you and look out for you no matter what, even as a voice. I am trying to, trying to take care of you. I'm doing my best and our best are all that we can do. So please, Please take care of yourself, okay? Don't forget to drink plenty of water and make sure your nails don't grow too long. Make sure to scrub behind your ears and don't forget to brush your teeth before bed. Okay? Stretch your skin, too. I mean, I don't know about where you are, but where I am, it sometimes gets miserably cold, and my skin sometimes it gets miserably dry and starts cracking and bleeding. But I mean. I had some lotion with me right now. I do. I make some uh, lotion rubbing noises to uh, I don't know soothe your ears or something and moisturize you. But unfortunately, I don't have it on me right now, and I'm just sort of improving. So. <laughs> but I'll do a lotion ASMR eventually. I think that'd be nice. Lotion sounds can sound nice. I've heard some lotion ASMR that sounds good. E. But if I do end up doing that, gonna need to be really careful not to get it on my mic because that's one huge thing I fear is the lotion just me rubbing it and just a little speck of it going flying a little bit. I know it pr probably won't affect much but I don't know, this mic was pretty expensive, and I don't want to ruin it at all, you know? Uh, but don't get me wrong, I will make you guys a lotion, or an ASMR, uh, that involves lotion eventually, and be really careful when doing it, of course. 
just, that's not this one. <laughs> I could do that now, though. Lots of pops for you. sleep in too much because I plan on running around after and trying to get some exercise after I wake up that is not after I record this video because it's like four in the morning but yeah I'm kind of sleepy actually come to think of it I'm always sleepy. I have like so many playlists just full of ASMR audios that I sleep to. And if my audios aren't enough, you can go check those out too. Because the people who make those audios are very, very talented people. And I'm actually friends with a couple of them. Not all of them, though. There's some really big ones that I've spoken to, but yeah. Uh, but yeah, I mean, when I used to upload consistently once a month, being a part of this community was like very, very good for me, and it did a lot for me. It made me feel happy and I don't know when I left I 
heart started feeling a little more distant from it and a little more lonely. Of course, that's not the only reason I, f I often feel lonely. But, yeah. sister up. I sit in this one cafe and I used to sit there after school and sometimes during school when I was in a panic when I, back when I was in high school and I just come down there and the reason that sitting there makes me feel lonely now is that when I was in high school I was a high school student, and a lot of high school students just go there. And basically, now everyone I knew from there is sort of gone now. And it's really sad because there's all these new faces. And yeah, I mean, I'm not much older than them but at the same time, I feel like it'd be sort of weird to talk to them. And it just makes me feel really alone just sitting there playing on my DS or my Switch or just drawing or something. And just, yeah. Everyone's just hanging out with each other and I'm just... <sighs> I wish that, as an adult, that friends uh, or schedules could work better for hanging out, but unfortunately, uh, it's not, it doesn't work that way, and I guess that's okay. But, yeah. Loneliness can get very, very sad, and I'm very sorry if you're alone right now, because I know how it feels, that feeling that you're just going to be alone forever, but you're not going to be alone forever. Okay, I'm here with you now, in your ear, and you can listen to my audios anytime you want, and I'll be here, and if you get tired of my voice, there are plenty of other ASMRists who make audios that are just as comforting. In fact, I feel like the fact that I didn't really plan this one out, and I don't plan a lot of my audios out, makes them less comforting than other audios. So, I mean, yeah, there are plenty of ASMRists who are more comforting than me. But I'm not telling you to leave. Don't get me wrong. I think I went off track a little bit, but what I'm trying to say is that the reason I make these is because listening to these sorts of audios uh, has helped me out in hard times. 
and just made me feel as though I'm not alone. You're not alone either. Because I'm here. And even though I can't do much, I want to make you feel happy. Okay. You're not alone. You matter. I care about you very, very much. I'm here for you, and I'm not going anywhere. Okay. Mm-hmm.